How's it going everyone? My name is Adrian and today I'm going to be playing a game called I'm Still Here. Yet another Ichio game and it was in the horror section so I feel like it's going to be spooky. Click to begin. You. Ah, finally moving into my new place. A chance to start a new life. The landlord seemed a little weird about this place but I don't have time to worry about that. I need to finish putting those books away. All right, so here are the controls. Dining room, dining room, dining room, room. Dining room, dining, dining room, room. Why am I singing a Christmas song? Do I gotta put this here? <laughs> oh, okay. Uh, oh, here we go, nice. All right, well, geez, this is probably gonna take a little while. I'm just putting some books in the thing and the stuff and the doing the thing and then I'm doing all the stuff and I'm doing the thing and I'm putting all the books on the stuff and the thing. Here we go. Booky booky bookity book. Here's another one. Bing bang boom. Why did these two fall? I don't even know. There we go. That's the thing and the stuff there. All right. Here we go. This is peak gaming 2019 everybody. Putting books on a bookshelf. Boom. Boom. At least I could do it all the way from here. Are these the only books that I have? What the heck? Why are my books moving? Darn it! I need to figure out what's going on. Jesus. I should ask the internet for help. <laughs> okay. Well, the first, first uh, line of action is to ask the internet when Wahoo answers. <laughs> Okay, uh, text selection. How do, why don't my books stay on my shelf? Whenever I put my books on my shelf, they fall off. Why does it do that? You should throw your books away. Reading is for nerds. To the person who answered this, I'm sure if you would actually read books, you would know how to spell reading correctly. Why don't my stuff stay still? You got ghosts, bro. You need to perform an exorcism. I don't know. Oh, okay. I think I think they're correct. I think they're correct. I <laughs> Okay, yeah, definitely ghosts. I should ask the internet how to get rid of these ghosts. <laughs> how do I get rid of a ghost who is whipping books around in a circle? I read in a book once that ghosts don't like it if you mess with the light switch. Okay. Hmm, this sounds promising. I should flip my lights on and off to, an to annoy the ghosts. How do I get out? Okay, there we go. Uh, where's the light switch? Haha! Ha. Ooh, ee, ah, ooh, ee, ah, ooh, ee, ah, ooh, ee, ah, ooh, ooh. Cut that out, dude! Jeez! <laughs> Who said that? Get out of my house! No way, this is my house. Stop being such a jerk. This is my house now. You must be dead. Oh, wow, this is heavy. My spear must be stuck here because my body still needs to be put to rest. That makes sense to me. <laughs> Speaking so casually to a ghost. Will you help me find my body then? <laughs> sure thing, dude, if it will get you to leave me alone. I'll find your body and put you to rest. <laughs> All right, I never... <laughs> Never expected this. Is it in the toilet? Hey, that's me! <laughs> you found me! So that's how I died. Wow, this is heavy. Well, can you help me move on so I can stop haunting this place? I'll finally put you to rest, little buddy. <laughs> oh no! I'm free! Rest in peace, little buddy. I'll always remember you. <laughs> is Tell me that's not it, dude. Tell me that's not it. You go on to have a peaceful night and live comfortably in your new apartment, but you can never shake the memory of your little friend. You occasionally take a peek in the toilet and dream of finding them there again, but all you find in the bowl is emptiness. Occasionally there is a turd if you forgot to flush earlier. <laughs> The end. Oh my god, I can't believe that. <laughs> oh my god. Well, I'm gonna, I feel like there's a little bit more that I could have done here. Um, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Moving to the new place. 
put the books here. I feel like there's a little bit more that could have been done. Like I didn't search everywhere. And I kind of want to get the full scope of this game before I just call it quits. No, you got to stay on there, books, bookies. There was also another thing that I could search on the internet or many other things that I could search on the internet. So why don't I check out all that this game has to offer? Since, you know, the developers put a good amount of time. Okay, what the heck? Why are my books moving? Go! It's a ghost! Well, let me, why don't my bathroom lights work? Check your breaker wires. One of them might be loose. Why don't my parents talk to me? You should try calling your parents to make sure they aren't dead. Oh my God, that took a dark turn. How do I print screen using a Mac? Command shift four. Well, I'm using Windows, so I don't need that. How do I delete my internet history? You can't delete it, dude. You gotta destroy the laptop. Oh, let me read the question. I just looked at porn on my mom's laptop and I don't know how to delete my history. Oh my God. How do I know if I'm being haunted? What are the symptoms of a haunting? Because I think I'm being haunted right now. Things move around on their own. Creepy voices, lights don't work. How do I keep things from moving? My things keep moving around and I can't never find anything I need. Please help. You should probably declutter your life and find a spot for everything you have. Wow, that got pretty existential. I have dreams where I'm driving and brakes don't. Oh my God. Keep having this dream where I'm driving, but the brakes don't work. What does it mean? If you're driving in your dreams, it means you feel in control. But when the brakes are broken, you feel like you are losing control. Maybe you're losing control of something in your life. I have some voodoo stuff going on. There's all these creepy sounds and my TV keeps changing channels. Sounds like when my grandma had spirits messing with her. If you can get their attention, you can ask them to stop. All right, I have a painful lump in armpit. It won't go away. It is not a zit or a mosquito bite. There's a good chance you have an infection. You should make sure you're washing thoroughly and shaving carefully. There's also likelihood that could, oh my God, geez. I have a problem with stuff moving by itself. I'm not even touching it or anything. My things keep floating around in junk. Help! Exclamation point, exclamation point, one. Sounds like... Thank you. Sounds like some voodoo stuff to me. You should do... You should do get a witch doctor or something. <laughs> I have a ghost I want to piss off? I think the ghosts like me, so I want to be annoying to them. What do I do? When I want to annoy my sister, I flip the light switch over and over. It gets to her every time. Hmm, this sounds promising. I should flip my light switch on and off. All right. Uh, I can't stop feeling bad. Not sure what's wrong, but I can't stop thinking about bad things. Have you tried stop feeling bad? But seriously, you should see a therapist. I can't get my dog to stop barking. My stupid dog keeps barking and barking will not stop. How do I make him shut up? Grab a glass of water next time your dog starts to bark. When it barks, throw water at it. Repeats this until it understands your command. Dude, that's messed up. I don't agree with that at all. I can't get my books to stay still. Whenever I put them down, they crawl across the room and squeak. You probably got rats, dude. Put out some mouse traps. I can't get ghosts to leave my house. I'm too scared to sleep at night because of the ghosts in my room. Please help me. Why would you want the ghosts to leave? Can I can't get spirits to pay attention to me. I want to talk to the ghost, but a Ouija board isn't working. What else can I use? Try turning the lights on and off over and over. Spirits have bad eyesight, so they can only see light and can't read a Ouija board. Well, you Stop it! My God! Why don't... The ghosts in my house like me. I just want to be their friend, but they are so mean to me. What do I do? You should try being an annoying jerk back so they know how it feels. Why don't my... Okay, I already know this stuff. How do I? Okay. All right, so I've done everything I can do there. Um, yeah, there's another room over there. What is going on in here? Oh. I thought there was more to this place, but I guess not. All right, well, the only thing I can do is this. Bing, bang, boom, bing, bang, boom, bing, bang, boom, bing, bang, boom. Cut that out, dude. Jeez. All right. Yep, yep, yep. I know all this stuff. Let me find the thurlet. Boom. Hey, that's me. You found me. Sorry, little fishy. All right, let me go ahead and flush this guy. I'm free. Rest in peace, little buddy. I'll always remember you. <laughs>
All right, well, I somehow didn't notice that my SD card on my camera was full, so the footage of me cut out. I'm sorry about that, but it's not a huge deal. Anyway, that was I'm Still Here, and that was actually a pretty fun and interesting and delightful game. It definitely wasn't a scary game, because there were no jump scares or spooky anything going on other than books flying around in a circle. But you could tell the developers really spent a good amount of time kind of fleshing out everything. And yeah, I enjoyed this. If you guys want to try this game out for yourself, go ahead and click the link down below in the description. But until next time, that's all the time I have left for this video. Thank you all so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. If you did, feel free to hit that like button down below. Go ahead and leave me a comment. Let me know what you thought about the video. And if you're new to the channel and you want to catch a new video up to five days a week, make sure you hit that subscribe button down below for me as well. Thanks again for watching everyone, and I can't wait to see you on the next video. Take it easy.